Hello everyone, it's Sonika here. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you six steps to really achieve your goal in less time. So let's get started. So the first step that you want to do is to get crystal clear about your goal. That is very important because only if you can be very specific about what you want exactly that you can really achieve it so for example if you just say i want more money but you need to ask yourself like how much exactly do i want like you need to answer to the question like how much money exactly do i need to make in order to set me financially free because everybody is different it's like you just have to follow your path and know what you need in order to manifest that in your reality and that is very important because only if you know where you're going that you know what path to take okay so that is very important specification clarity is everything here and you also have to be very specific about the date as well so that you know what you want and you also need to know when you can obtain it step number two all you need to do is so simple just write that down into existence this practice is so simple yet very effective it's like you are writing your goal and dream on a piece of paper like you can imagine it's like a magic paper where you can just write everything down and then it will just manifest and this thing is so simple it's like you are creating something from your head into reality but just that it's on the paper but in the long run if you know that you really want it so much and that you are committed to have it you achieve it for sure so the practice is very simple just get a piece of paper and then write the goals that you want to achieve and also the date that you will obtain it so be specific about what you want and the date and be specific like give as many details as possible what i want you to do is to write that down in present tense because it's how you really convince your subconscious mind that you already obtain it or you are sure that you will obtain it in that specific date this is like magic because it's like you are playing you are working with your subconscious mind and you are attracting that to you through many different steps that i will mention in the next next step now we've come to the step number three which is so popular among successful people many successful people use this whether they know it or not this is the key to success so visualization is how you see something that you want in your head so crystal clear that you feel like it already happened and you're so sure that it is yours okay so visualization is something very similar to imagination and i would just say the ability to visualize is the greatest thing on earth because it will get you everywhere i really love a quote from albert einstein and that is logic will get you from a to b and imagination will take you everywhere and that is really really true because once i know how to visualize and imagine like i can see how big the world is i can go everywhere in my imagination and visualization and then i could express and manifest that in my reality which is so awesome to do so i often play with it and it's kind of fun it really um like a brain exercise to me so i truly love this very idea so it requires some time and some practice to be able to visualize and to see your goals so clearly like it happens in real life the reason why it is so effective is because like your subconscious mind does not know the difference between dreams and reality so it's kind of like when you imagine and visualize it's 
the process of how you trick your subconscious mind that you already obtain it and you are in alignment with that and that will just manifest in real life so the faster you can convince your subconscious mind that your desired result has already manifested the faster it will show up in your reality all right so we've come to this point where you are so crystal clear about your goal and that you even have it on the paper and you just see it in your head right so we've come to this point where you have to create an emotional connection to that goal so allow yourself to tap into the positive feeling associated with your goals and dreams so just notice how good it feels when you achieve that goal and especially you can do this when you visualize or when you just jot it down on your journal or on your piece of paper like whenever you see your piece of paper whenever you think about your goals and dreams like you have to connect that emotional feeling with it and it it must be very positive and you can just double that feeling or triple that feeling to just make it strong enough that it attracts that thing to you because that is quite powerful honestly so use your emotion it is everything so it can be the feeling of joy love peace gratitude or excitement or any other positive feelings and you just have to be positive while at the same time you have to stay away from negative thoughts and emotions because that may slow down your manifestation process all right so step number five take action this sounds a little bit too serious right now but it is very crucial all you need to do is to just acknowledge that the action is the key ingredient here while the other steps are so important action is the bridge between your dreams and your reality so action is everything it's like you just have to take action but somehow somewhere you may feel like oh i don't know where to start so it's just fine just try to think of one small thing that you can do right now because it doesn't have to be something so out of reach or so significant but just know that you do something about it you take action like you know where you're going and just take small steps to achieve that so you know that you are in alignment with where you are going like you are in alignment with your goal and you are walking towards that goal and even though you feel like oh i'm not sure of how this is gonna work but trust me if you practice all the steps that I've mentioned, you've got to know that it's so magical like there might be circumstances and people that will come along the way that they will help you achieve that. So I want you to know that it is so normal that it may take some time for your goals and your dreams to manifest into reality but that is so normal so all you need to do is to keep in mind that action is what you love most it's like you've got to keep in mind that you love the process as much as the result because that is the key we cannot just think of the result all the time without enjoying the process because life is like a journey while we love the result so much that we've got to love the process because even if you reach one goal and you want to continue succeeding you need to work even harder so why not start like a simple step so that you can really achieve that thing and enjoy it along the way like you are enjoying it so make sure that your goal is in alignment with who you are with your life purpose and everything and make sure that you enjoy it all right so we've come to the final step to help you achieve your goal faster and that is confidence and faith so you need to believe in yourself in your capacity and ability and 
believe that the universe has your back and the goal is attainable and that you can achieve it and it is yours to claim so this can be achieved by repeated affirmations and positive self-talks like I am good enough, I am worthy, I know I am lucky enough to achieve my goals, and I am capable of everything that I dream of, I am God's child so that I can attain everything that I want, I know that it is mine and there are so many other positive affirmations that you can tell and keep in mind so that you believe in yourself and that is very powerful and i also have a self-confidence formula from the book think and grow rich that i really love if you haven't read that just go find one and read it that is a great great book that i would recommend to everybody and i would love to share this self-confidence formula in the description box below you may want to check it out and practice self-confidence so my last message right now to everyone is that you are in control of your own life and nobody does but you and I have a great quote from Oprah Winfrey that I really love and the quote states that like you want to be in the driver's seat of your own life if not life will drive you and that is really true because you do have the control over your life and I know that if you believe in it if you believe in yourself like you can have whatever you want you will surely obtain it so don't ever doubt okay just give a 100 percent belief all right so that is the end of the video today and i hope today's video was helpful and let me know in the comment down below which steps were your favorite and what are you gonna apply in your life and Make sure you subscribe to this channel if you haven't already and see you guys in the next one. Bye guys!